I have got to be dreaming. Look at what I just pulled out of here. That is the third jug from this spot. Ten license plates, three jugs, an insulator, a bean pot, two blob tops, a cream de mint, Larkin Company, two cobalt inks. I I'm literally like, going to call this the heaven hole now. I just pulled this out. It is cr it's cracked, but it's a great radium water company. Pittsford, Pitts, or, uh, Pittsburgh, Pittsfield, Mass. It's kind of odd, but like I said, it's got a crack in it. But since I've never even heard of that, I'm probably going to still keep it. And there's the jug from before. I found a few other things. Nothing really other, anything else really special. Amber Vaseline, a shoe polish. This one's kind of cool. I have bakers and a doorknob but I'll, uh, I'll catch back if I find anything else great I haven't been uh, finding too much more um, I got a broken uh, broken milk but uh, yeah that would have been cool but and I got that cork top up there and I just pulled uh, this out and a little uh, little uh, relish jar or something it's pretty neat though it's cork top now I got something else actually showing I don't know what it is but hopefully you can see that I'll shine the light on it right there it's like white maybe it handled another jug I don't know we'll find out I just pulled out this one I showed my friend, it's all the way from Chicago. We're in New Hampshire, so that just tells you a good reference. And I guess he's going to come over and join me because he's not finding nothing. But I found a broken milk, by the way, just like you did. Did you? Yeah, then he got this real awesome top. I think it's off of C.A. King myself, but I'm not. Could be wrong. I get the, like, all, sorry, all I got was the Carters. Alright guys, I just found this. That's really nothing, it's just a junk beer. But uh, normally I can't stand condiment bottles. But uh, this one on the other hand... <laughs> I think I'll be taking that one home. <laughs> I thought it was one of those junk premieres and I yanked on it. So thank God I didn't break it. Wow. Hey guys, I'm back at the house. I cleaned everything up. I thought I'd show it to you. Um, little, uh, jar. Um, this is actually pretty cool. Uh, e. Harrison and Sons Boston Mass. Salvage DVD. I've had a bunch of those before, but this one's almost like a aqua variant. And I can't clean the inside. Because I got the end of my brush stuck in the neck. <laughs> uh, and, uh, this is a nice uh, little inkwell. But uh, I thought it was blank until I looked at the bottom. It actually says Carter's. Usually these are blank. And then uh, a nice little pepper shaker. And, uh, this cool one. It doesn't say anything, but it's a nice shape. And then uh, this one's got... Oh, a lot of the paper label on it. It's a shoe polish. I can't stand those, but I kept it anyway because I like the color. But I didn't realize I had the label on it. And this is the Chicago bottle. G A Knoblanche Druggist. Bolive Street, Chicago. This is the weirdest medicine bottle I've ever found, besides the Dr. Daniel's Oyster Cacos or whatever. That is, that is the second weirdest medicine I've ever found. And uh, this is pretty cool. It's an amber Vaseline. I don't find too many of those compared to the clear ones. Now this is the crack soda I showed you in the video. Great Radium Spring Water Company Incorporated. Pittsfield Mass. As you can see, it's badly cracked though. There's the jug. Cleaned it all up. 
got the handle everything. That is jug number three. Well, jug number five. Three intact. I have found two broken ones up under there, though. Then uh, that one I haven't cleaned because it's got the label. And then uh, this, this is pretty cool, too. It's, it's got all, a lot of the label left on it, and it's a condiment. Look at that stretch bubble. It's nice blown. That's beautiful. I like that jar. So anyway, guys, please like, comment, subscribe, and more ding videos. Hopefully, we'll continue soon. Must have made a